Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Tomb Raider Definitive Edition. Yes, I know I should not be making this because it is an older game, but who cares? I wanted to play it. So, maybe some people out there want to watch me play it for my second time. How about that? I beat it on the 360. I thought it was one of the better games out there. So here we go. Plus, uh, I think this comes with all DLC and such, so even more content. Yay. I will not be talking during cutscenes. So, yeah. But here we go. Save. Uh, yeah, I'm a pussy, so no. Just a big bully he is. Hitting girls. What's up with that? I feel like I'm breaking out my cocoon because I am the new Laura Croft. If anyone understands what, what I'm talking about, you should, should understand what I'm saying. Well, you can die like this, you just choose not to. Eh. 
Yeah, this is gonna hurt. Yeah, here we go. I'm on fire. It's official. And we. I tap that X like I tap her. I mean, it didn't sound right. No, 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 no. I didn't say that. Maybe I did. I don't know. You're all thinking it. Shut up. Just gonna go, go over here. <laughs> He's cute. Let's go flirt with him. Yeah. Or her. Um. Him? Or, I think I say it's her. Either way. I don't care. Flammable barriers. Okay. Give me. Yep. X. Here we go. Yeah, burn. Realistic uh, burnage there. Yes. Why'd well, have to say? Throw a fire. Oh. Oh. I got this. Don't worry. It's been a while, so yeah, that's my big excuse. Get off me, rape. That was close. Oh, shit, that was close. Yeah, was close. that? A pretty lady <laughs> with hair clipping through the body and it's magnificent HD. Keep going. Just keep going. Just keep going. Just keep on going. I'm the worst singer in the world, by the way, so, you know, you are allowed to throw up when you hear my voice. By all means. Guys, just to let you know ahead of time, or if this is the right time, I don't know. Um, I'll be playing this as stealthy as possible because I am a stealth master. That's a lie. I am not in the slightest bit the best at stealth, but I like to attempt it because everyone in their own mind should feel like Sam Fisher. Right? Push. Push. Okay, I'm doing something wrong here. Jump. Yeah. yeah. I'm a genius. Come here, look at me. Look at me. What's this on? Burn. Congratulations. I set a box on fire. That should be an achievement. Push or burn. Burning works too. Push.
Whatever. Run. That rocks just, you know, defies freaking physics, man. It doesn't care. I, you know, that would have just, just ran through a tree branch. Yep. I feel like I'm playing Sonic in a way, just, you know, Sonic slowed down 10 times speed. Rape! He's back! He's back! Oh, okay. I'm slow! Wow! Something so simple as that, and I failed. I'm, I'm so disappointed, but you guys got to see it then, so. Now you get to see his imminent doom. Yeah. Goodbye, light. Goodbye. I found a new light, God. He is mine. I almost missed that too. It's, I'm a failure. Don't judge me. A girl with this much, like, just speed in her life, you know. She's, she's an alien. She's an alien. What is it, Crow? All right. Running. Funny. Art. Is this art? What is art? I will not be looking at that, by the way. Not now, at least. So if you're, you know, you're into that kinky stuff of art galleries and video games, I'm, I'm sorry, man. Or woman. Whatever, you know, slimy ghoul. Just like I'm not gonna show it right now. So more important matters is crossing a giant tree log over a cliff because this is what she does. She's crazy. It's like she's just crazy. Has anyone? Okay, here's a serious question. It's gonna be random, but I am random. Has anyone ever imagined what would happen if you mixed Laura Croft and Bear Grylls together? I mean, think about it. Think about it. I know she's not real, but. Still, somebody tell me what would come out. And don't, for the love of God, do not say Chuck Norris. I can do, that. do not. She can do that. Just do it! Yesterday you said tomorrow. No, she, she literally just said it now. I'm gonna grab her. I'm glad that's where I was supposed to grab. Cause <laughs> I don't know. I feel like you're, if you actually stay 
and you're still here, if I keep making these, you're going to witness a lot of idiocy deaths probably again. So I am warning you about that right now. The way the water goes down this rock and then into the ground immediately getting absorbed it's it's glorious this see that water right there it drips off so i have no excuse look at that so pretty so gorgeous oh scramble no, press a oh okay why my mind didn't piece that one together right off the bat i don't care Ah! Sam! They must have come this way. That is that. said I wouldn't talk during cutscenes, but you know, I'm a liar. Get used to it. Get used to it, kid. But, um, what? No. Out of everything, and this is, this is your downfall. Is that small ledge. Okay. You know what, guys? Hang on. All right, and I'm back. I just put on subtitles in case of volumes too low or high or something. You know, I don't know. I want to shoot that. Now guys, don't look at her butt, you perps. looks like a scared little puppy a cute little scared puppy the soon-to-be world-famous archaeologist, Lara Croft, in her native habitat. She's on the hunt for the lost kingdom of Yamatai, home to the fabulous Himiko, mythical sun queen, and empress to yours truly. <laughs> Sam, this is serious. Oh, sweetie, I know. I'm just trying to lighten the mood here. Everyone's so on edge. What are you so worried about? I'm close to something. I'm sure of it. I just don't know if the others will listen. Or even if they should. Lara, you know this stuff better than anyone. Seriously, I'm not just saying this to make you feel better. I trust you, Roth trusts you, you got this. Now let's take a break, okay? Okay, okay. And Sam, thanks. She's not always this serious, you know. Oh, yes. 
can you suggest? I'm not serious about this expedition, Laura. It's not just Sam's family funding us. I put my savings on the line, too. You've all got some kind of stake in this. The funding won't last forever, Whitman. That's precisely why we should push east, not west. No one believes Yamata... No one believes Yamata is that far east. The books simply don't support it. Well, whoever wrote those books never found Yamata. I talked to Russ about this. There's no point in following in other people's footsteps, Dr. Whitman. I refuse to bet my reputation on your hunch. I'm the lead archaeologist here. And when were you last in the field with a TV crew behind you? Got 30 years experience, two PhDs, one in East Asian history. So why don't you stick to boats, Mr. Grimm? Ship, Dr. Whitman. It's a ship. Don't need a PhD to know Look, that. Going east will take us directly into the Dragon's Triangle. That's where we need to go. <sighs> Lara, my little bird. I'd follow you almost anywhere, but that place, a bad energy. Bad storm, more like, makes the Bermuda Triangle look like Disney World. <laughs> Sign me up. The stories about Queen Himiko say she could summon storms. Myths are usually based on some version of the truth. What if Yamatai was somewhere in the Triangle itself? Well, look, this is the satellite imagery from inside the Dragon's Triangle. That doesn't look good. If it's wet, I can sail on it. Oh, don't tell me you're serious. Enough! Can... Reyes is right. We don't have the funds to piss about. It's now or never. Lara's offering fresh ideas and a plan. I'm the captain here. It's my decision. We're going into the Dragon's Triangle. Why am I even here? She can't just sit. Oh, boy. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that's episode one of Tomb Raider Definitive Edition. I hope you enjoyed, even though we did pretty much absolutely nothing except nearly get ourselves killed. Didn't even get a weapon. That's next episode. So if you enjoyed this, please leave a like, share, subscribe, unsubscribe, dislike, leave hate messages. It's all up to you. See you in the next episode.